is Bruno. And now we're going back home and I'm going to tell you how to find a girlfriend if you're socially awkward. <clears throat> the first thing, ah yes, yeah, so I'm 35 years old, so probably I have more experience than most of you guys. And I had a few girlfriends and most of the times I found them or they found me the same way. And as you can see from my videos, I'm not the best person at talking or obviously not very good at interacting with others. And I don't know if that's just my, the real me or just a label or a persona or a mask I, I wear for whatever reason, but it's just the way it is right now at least. And what I always thought is, okay, so where is the girl I like? Obvious, obviously, I, I wouldn't be able to date, let's say, a party girl because I wouldn't be able to go to parties. So let's imagine I'm a, I'm a tennis player. So I guess I would want to date a, a girl who also plays tennis. So we have something in common to share, at least at the beginning. Or if I am a bookworm, I guess the girl I like is at the library. But in my case, I'm guessing the girl I like is probably at home, playing video games or, I know, playing Final Fantasy or watching The Walking Dead or Game of Thrones, something like that. And chances are I will never meet her. That's why I just took the leap and I assumed that the girl I liked also sometimes goes out for some meetings. And what I did was always printing lots of business cards, a couple of hundred at least, and finding some meeting online in the city or the country where I was. So it could be from meetup.com or from car surfing, some events. And then I go to some events that I may be interested in. For example, I don't like, and I cannot go out at night because I have problem with my vision. So I would go things in the morning, like for example, to play frisbee or for sometimes there are movies in the afternoon or there are some lessons so I just go there and talk to people and give my business card to everyone in my case because I was a teacher before so I had the excuse that I was looking for a job so if they knew some anybody who wanted to learn Spanish they could get them in touch get them to contact me okay. And it happened many times that some girls, maybe they thought I was interesting for some reason and they, instead of writing me for a job, they wrote me to invite me for coffee or invite me for something. And that's how I found the girlfriends I had. It sounds simple and it really is. And I didn't have to put any work and I didn't have to deal with rejection. Because unless you are a professional, like pickup artist, you get down when, when they reject, when girls reject you, you feel very bad. So this is a way to putting yourself out there without getting hurt. And I hope you enjoyed it.